Hello everyone, welcome back to the A30H YouTube channel and today we're starting a new series called Andrew's Treasure Hunting Chronicles. I've got a bit of a head start at this property that was a permission, uh, don't dig anywhere that you're not certain isn't public, but I asked permission here and I've got my first signal so let's see what it is. Okay, for everyone new to metal detecting, see how I did a circle here? I'm going to flip it up here in a second. It's easier to fill in that way. So you just take this, oh, keep it up like that. You got an easier replacement. Let's get the gear up here now. I should be right around it. Check my holes before I fill them back in to make sure I didn't miss anything. Did I grab it? I thought these were coins when I pulled the first one out. Another copper color one. Do I have any hands? That's on the battery. Well, we're going to cut back to you and we're going to see, we're going to dig everything out of this hole. This was definitely luck and not skill on my part. So we dug the rest of the hole and filled it back in. We pretty much tapped it dry, but this is probably the best piece we pulled out of it. And I did a little research. Most likely 1930s to 1940s means the uh, World War II was going on. And uh, don't mind that, it's a Garrett Carrot baby. And uh, so they did a lot of trade items instead of printing a lot of currency, henceforth why, you know, nickels had some silver in them. And uh, uh, there was a steel penny in 1943. Uh, they used trade items instead of currency. So we just dug another hole here and we pulled up. Looks to like attack of some sort. Interesting. It's scratchy, so I'm not really. Well, if it's a 69, I gotta dig it. chunk of metal. And everything. Low mid 80 signal. 
If I had to guess, this is gonna be a coin. I'm not telling I'm not saying which one, but it's gonna be a coin. a high 70 signal by the way that last dig good thing i didn't put money on it because we found wires it was not a coin if we would have plucked into those the whole street would have lost electricity so we'll see where this one takes us hopefully it's not more ground wires oh it's a part of a fork for a spoon. Something like that. Oh, it's a coin. It's a coin. Okay. First coin of the day. <laughs> it's quarter size, which is not promising. Oh, that's a clad quarter all right. What lucky year did we <laughs> what lucky year did we Oh 1980. Very nice. A real relic. This is a 1980 Washington quarter. <laughs> a little D on it. That makes two of us. Pulled up a nice 75 signal. That is the nose of a 45 long Colt bullet. Somebody shot it. There's the final board. I don't think you saw the 38 bullet right there. Top of can, quartz, and little toy car parts. But other than that, I do believe everything was included in the video. And, of course, the crown jewel of the day. The trolley token. Information given that I found late 1930s, early 1940s, but probably one of my better finds to date. And uh, overall, a pretty good day. And as for me and my partners over at the A38s, we are signing off. If you liked this video, hit that like button. If you like our content, hit that subscribe button. And if you want even more content, we have an Instagram page, A38s Ohio, so go follow us over there. And that would be it. And I'll see you sometime in the future. Bye-bye. Garrett, if you ever watch this. Hey, you're not supposed to look, dummy. Please sponsor the video. We need money.